My name is Robert Rhee. I'm the Chief of Vascular and Endovascular Surgery at Maimonides Medical Center. I believe that our fellowship training program here is one of the best in the country. It offers the most diverse experience you can possibly get, ranging from uh, complex open operations to aortic branch graft work. We have been involved with multiple clinical trials involving um, endovascular as well as open surgical um, procedures. So the fellowship experience will include many of the um, cutting edge and the state-of-the-art uh, research protocols that we've been um, involved with. I think the biggest reason why I wanted to come here was uh, particularly Dr. Ree. Um, the, the experience and the name that he carries um, is definitely something that's, uh, that's unique. He's definitely one of the, the big name vascular surgeons um, in, the, in, in the United States. So the opportunity to work with him was definitely something that, that I wanted. You know, that personal relationship to work with him one-on-one -on -one is something that's unique that you won't get at you know, many other fellowships. The Mamanagis Medical Center Vascular Surgery Fellowship has been around for close to 30 years. Uh, it's one of the oldest fellowships in New York City, as well as the country. Uh, vascular surgery encompasses all the aspects of vascular diseases throughout the body, including carotids, peripheral, abdominal aortic aneurysms, abdominal aneurysms. We do a lot of open aortic cases, which is something that, you know, throughout the United States, becoming a more and more rare experience at a lot of other places they don't they don't get to they don't get to have that kind of exposure. Dr. Ree holds us to a very high standard. Um, he wants us to be the best as far as evidence-based medicine and our technique and he really pushes you. He also is a wealth of knowledge. From day one it's a very personal experience that you get with the attendings but I think the experience is sort of a gradual experience. As your comfort gets better, as your training gets better, you become more comfortable doing more and more. But I think uh, from day one, you're kind of put in the position where you know, you're expected to kind of orchestrate the case. And, and obviously, the attending is behind you, making sure that you're doing, you're doing everything appropriately. But as you become better and uh, more, more fit to doing uh, more and more, you're essentially, you, you transition to the role of the primary surgeon. Maimonides is a designated stroke center, is a level one center uh, trauma center, is a aortic center, and so the opportunity for a vascular surgeon to work with trauma surgeons, to work with uh, neurologists or stroke patients, to work with a cardiovascular surgeon, gives us as trainees a wide diversity and exposure to various pathologies that perhaps may not uh, be available at another institution. The strength of Mamadi's fellowship is that it has a lot of history. Um, it's a, a very solid fellowship. Mamadi is one of the largest hospitals in uh, Brooklyn as well as uh, New York City. Uh, we have a variety of vascular pathology uh, and tremendous amount of volume. It is a uh, immigrant rich population. Um, it is a population that is very densely um, uh, compacted into this area so that uh, most of the patients that we treat are essentially coming in uh, from a five mile radius. Because of the dense uh, population here, um, the caseload uh, and the case mix is incredibly abundant. I got to see a couple of T-cars, um, so carotid uh, cases, that I had never seen before, only read about or seen videos of. And uh, actually we have a uh, carotid subclavian bypass coming up today. I think the relationship that we have with our attendings is something that's very unique. You essentially have a very personal relationship with the attending, where the attending you know, treats you as, instead of treating you as a fellow, they treat you as a junior attending, and they expect you to kind of moderate the case and, and dictate how things go and how things are done. I think one of the most unique aspects of our program is the autonomy that you'll get. All of our attendings are committed to um, allowing the fellows to have significant uh, independence in the operating room. And that's not really 
uh, a common place. Our program is one of the few programs in the country that actually is committed for, to teach in that uh, fashion.